Do you have some expired medicine laying around and you would love to know if you can actually still use it instead of throwing it away and wasting the money that you spent on it? I'm Nick, welcome to All Our Questions, where I search the internet for questions that we all want answers to, and I answer them. Today's question is, do pharmaceutical drugs really expire? We're gonna find out, and we're starting right now. If you're coming down with the flu or a cold or even a headache and you head over to the medicine cabinet and you grab your medicine, the very last thing that you wanna see is that your medicine's been expired by six months. Am I right? In that situation, do you risk taking them to soothe your splitting headache even though it goes against the explicit recommendation of the pharmaceutical company? Let me know in the comments down below in situations like that, what do you normally do? The industry says that taking drugs that have gone past their expiry date is dangerous, but some people say that it's a scam invented by the pharma companies to get you to buy more of their drugs. But is it really a scam? I mean, it's not surprising at all that a conspiracy theory emerged from this because tons of people, myself included, have taken expired medicine either on purpose or on accident, and they haven't had any ill effects at all. None, zero, zip, zilch, nada. So are the conspiracy theorists right? Do drugs really never expire and they just lead us to believe that so that we can keep funneling more and more money into the pockets of the pharmaceutical companies? Well, the answer to that question, well, it's not as simple as a yes or a no. The fact remains that pharmaceutical companies are required by law to sell their products with expiration dates, but this doesn't mean that the drugs are useless or dangerous past this date. In fact, they could last for years longer than the listed expiration date. The largest study ever conducted on the expiration of drugs was conducted by the US military who wanted to know if their ginormous stockpile of drugs was gonna expire on them after a short period of time, or if they could keep them in storage for longer periods of time to save money. What they found was that 90% of the drugs were still usable after the expiration date, and some of them were still usable up to 15 years later. So does this mean that the expiration dates don't mean anything? Well. Not really. The term expiry, as defined by the pharmaceutical industry, is the date up to which they can guarantee the full effectiveness and strength of the drug. I'm gonna highlight this one and say it again because it's extremely important. The expiration date that's on the bottle is the date that the pharmaceutical companies guarantee the full strength and effectiveness of the drug that you're taking. This is important because doctors prescribe drugs at certain doses and strengths to ensure the proper effect. Think of it like this. If you're prescribed a certain strength of antibiotic to beat an infection, taking that antibiotic a year after the expiry date may mean that they might not be strong enough to do their job. It's also important to know that there have been instances to where ill effects have been caused from people taking expired drugs. For example, the antibiotic tetracycline has been known to cause renal damage if taken after the expiration date. Here's the thing to keep in mind when it comes to medicine. It's extremely difficult to predict an exact day that the medicine is going to expire because there are a lot of variables involved when it comes to how long it takes for the medicine to go bad. Where was the medicine stored? How hot or cold is the room where the medicine was stored? How humid was it where the medicine was stored? I mean, do you keep your medicine in the bathroom or do you keep it in the kitchen or do you keep it in a in a humidor? Was the bottle or packaging that the medicine came in properly sealed? And so on and so forth. I mean, you gotta keep all of that in mind too. Pharmaceutical companies use the expiration date system mainly to ensure that they're not liable for any unintentional effects caused by their drugs. The date on the package is therefore a very conservative estimate. So should you take a drug after it's expired? I mean, is it safe? Well. Evidence suggests that you might be okay, and other evidence suggests that you might not. So the thing that you really have to determine in that case is, is it really worth the risk? If you enjoyed this video, remember to give it a thumbs up. If you're interested in watching more of my videos, you can click on either of these videos over here. If you're on a desktop, if you are on a mobile device, there'll be a link down in the description below that will send you to a playlist full of videos. And if you're not already subscribed, make sure to hit the subscribe button somewhere on this page so you can get more answers to all our questions. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.